What is up everybody? Hungry Cabbygon here. It's a very good day today because it is launch day for a new set. We have got Miracle Twin. Yeah, I got two boxes. I'm gonna open this one. Pretty much every time I do this, the uh, second box is always better than the first box. I always complain about that. Very annoying, but um, oh well. As long as we get one good one, I'll be happy. Look at this. Very nice looking artwork. I like it. I think this will definitely be the GX to get, the Mew and the Mewtwo. What else we got on here? Some cool looking stuff. SM11. Launch day is actually tomorrow, uh, but uh, as always I have my ways. So I've got some a uh, little bit early. Let's get into it, see what we can get. I'm calling uh, at the moment the three most expensive cards. In no particular order will be Alternate Art. Mew and Mewtwo, uh, Misty Full Art, and Cherish Ball Gold Card. That's my prediction for the three most expensive cards. I don't know if that will prove to be correct, but that is my my guess. So I'm hoping that we can get one of them. That would be great. So a quick look at this pack. Very nice looking artwork. Um, so this is a proper full set, SM11. It is... Um, yeah, a big one. 90 something cards, a proper full one. Uh, let's see how we go. Hopefully we can do good. Gonna try not to take too long, but I, I always take a long time. Looking at some new artworks. I'll talk about some of the things that tickle my fancy. Ooh, alright. Straight away we've got a trainer card. What is this? Pokemon Kyuj King Kyujo. I don't know what that is. What is it? 89? It is Pokemon Lab. I read about this one. It's like you can put two fossil cards uh, into play or something like that. Uh, what does it say? Once during each player's turn, that player may search their deck for up to two Pokemon that evolve from identified fossil and put them onto their bench and shuffle their deck. Okay. That's a pretty good stadium if you're into the uh, playing those fossils. Not bad. Okay, what else have we got here? Jinx, why are you always so terrifying? Oh, we got something in this pack, I think. It's a Tapu Coco. Nothing too exciting looking there, I think. If your opponent's Pokemon is an Ultra Beast, it can do 200 for 3 energy. That's pretty good. Uh, but you got to trash 2 energy if you do that. That's not too bad. But uh, that's obviously reliance on your opponent playing. A deck that has Ultra Beasts in it. Alright, let's go. Hey, we got a Misty. I feel like this will be expensive. At least in the secret rare version, just because it's Misty. It let's you get three supporters from your deck. And put them into your hand. Oh, look at that artwork. It's so good. Alright, i got to try and go quick. Um, ooh, that's cool. Yeah, I feel like it will definitely be expensive. Just, I don't know, it's okay. Like, it's not terrible. But I feel like um, it's just misty, so it will be expensive, you know. For the full art, at least, we'll see if the, just the regular uncommon is that expensive. Hey, Kamala. We got Kamala, my boy. Um, seems to be a few Pokemon in this set which have not made an appearance for a while. Alright, we got, what's that, Aegis Slash? I always get them mixed up. Uh, Alright, I'm not going to go too much into all just the regular cards, we'll, we'll talk about them later. I'm mainly going to focus on the trainers and the GXs because I don't want to take too long to make this video and uh, I have limited memory space on the camera so I'm going to try and keep it as brief as possible. Okay, so some cool artwork so far but nothing too exciting. I haven't looked super closely at the set. I've looked at all the secret rares and the GXs and stuff, but um, yeah, not just the regular cards so far. So we'll have to see. Hey, Dratini, looking cool. <laughs> uh, he looks so out of it. I love it. He's just eating that weird fruit. Okay, we got Terrakion. That's actually the uh, set promo this time, but I haven't got. Uh, I haven't got. The shop I buy them from never gives you the promo, so what does it say? If your all your bench Pokemon have damage counters on them, it does 50 plus 150. That's pretty good. 
for three energy. Not bad. Ooh, stuff falling over on my desk. It's like covered in stuff. All right, what can we do here? There we got a fossil. There you go. There's that fossil. All right, so still kind of a slow start. Not necessarily a bad thing. We definitely want to get that Mew Mewtwo GX if possible. Seems like it, I feel like it will be the most expensive. All right, we got green there. Uh, after your turn ends, you draw until you have eight cards in your hand. So this is green, not blue. It's very confusing because it's like the opposite to English. Um, all right, what do we got in this pack? Oh, all right, we got our first one. We got the Mega Sableye. So Megas are back. Mega Sableye and Tyranitar. I'm going to quickly check what this does. Looks cool. I like the fact that the crystal, you can see like both their faces. It's pretty sweet. Um, right, I'm going to quickly briefly check what that does. Um, so this one seems to have very good <laughs> HP, 280, but it also has um, very heavy or very expensive uh, attack costs. So uh, Greed Crash, 210 for five energy. If your opponent's active Pokemon GX or EX is knocked out by damage from this attack, take one more prize card. That's pretty good, uh, but you need five energy. Giga Fall GX, 5 energy plus, 250 damage. If this Pokemon has at least 5 extra energy attached to it, in addition to this attack's cost, discard the top 15 cards of your opponent's deck. Okay, that's very good, obviously, but you need to have 11, 11 energy. No, wait, 5 plus, did I say plus 5? 10 energy on there. That is ridiculous. Um, but, I mean, it would be pretty devastating if you use that, so pretty cool. Alright, so we've we got a GX. That's good. That's a good start. <laughs> Finally. Did any? I'm going to kind of try and skip through as much as... Not skip through, but you know what I mean. Try to not make it take too, too long. Alright. So we're still looking for that Mew and Mewtwo. Hey, Alright, we got another holo. You can go... Oh, he's kind of off the camera. That's okay. My pile is falling over. What is happening? Okay. Let's go. Oh, we got a Steelix. Fighting type Steelix. That's cool. Hey, we got another Exeggutor. There's so many Exeggutors recently. You can do 180 damage for 3 energy, but you have to... What is it? You have to trash your hand. Oh, that's unfortunate. So, 180 damage, which is not really enough these days, honestly. Uh, we got the uh, weak guard energy, so provides one colorless, and your Pokemon has no weakness, I believe, is what it does. That's pretty cool. I like the concept of that. Kind of replace the weakness policy with just an energy card. Yes, all right, yes, we got it. Mew and Mewtwo, or Mewtwo and Mew GX. Um, I feel like definitely this is the best GX to get, and it looks awesome. Look at that. Alright, so it's got perfection is its ability. So it doesn't have a regular attack, but it can use any of your bench Pokemon or your trashed Pokemon's attacks. So very good. Throw it in any deck. Can do very good. Uh, still needs the energy, obviously. It's got Miracle Twin GX for 3 energy plus. Does 200 damage. If you have an extra 1 energy, uh, your, all your Pokemon get fully healed. That's crazy. So you do 200 damage and heal all your Pokemon. Very nice. I'm very happy with that artwork. On point. Very, very good. And the card seems very good. Definitely wouldn't mind throwing that in the old Reshizard deck. And it's got 270 HP, so... Looking good there. Um, psychic weakness, obviously, but uh, if people start playing fighting stuff, oh, look at that. That will destroy them. There we go, Celebi. Celebi. Okay, so, oh man, we still got a lot of packs to go. We got two GXs already, though, that's pretty good. Hopefully, this is a four, a four GX box. <laughs> Some of these artworks are really good. Oh, alright, we got a forest. 
What does it say? Uh, if your opponent's Pokemon is asleep, they have to flip two coins uh, to wake up. That's pretty annoying. And that's, uh, that's quite good. I don't mind that. Okay, what are we talking here? Uh, we got the giant bomb. So, basically, if you take more than 180 damage, the Pokemon that this is attached to, you can put 10 damage counters uh, on your opponent's Pokemon. I'm not sure if that's in any way you like Giant Bomb or, or not, but um, it's kind of like, what was that old one? The Bursting Balloon. Yeah, oh, look, there's Misty on the Lapras card. That's how we knew that um, there was going to be a full art, because she was in there. They always do that. And uh, his ability lets you get one uh, Misty out of your deck, out of your uh, trash, or out of your deck, out of your trash. So you can kind of just loop them. And then if we see that uh, Psyduck and, oh, oh, it... we might have a secret right here. Uh, hold on. Oh no, it's, we got three in the first half of the box, Aerodactyl. Okay, what can Aerodactyl do? Evolves from the fossil, obviously. Um, 210 HP, not too bad. Um, what does he do? Uh, as long as this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, the attacks of your opponent's ba basic Pokemon cost one energy more, that's annoying. Boulder Crush for 120, one fighting and two colorless, and Wild Dive GX 50 times for one fighting energy. This does 50 times damage the amount of energy attached to your opponent's active Pokemon. Pretty good. You can use that to knock out some like big hitters, some tag teams or something. It's pretty interesting. It only requires one energy, but it's not a basic, so you can't just like totally surprise them with it. But I guess if you're playing a fossil, they don't know what specifically you're going to evolve into. Um, could be a nice little surprise. Yeah, I totally thought that was the secret. I could see a glimpse of something on the edge, but it was obviously not texturing. Okay, alright, so we got three GXs in the first half of the box. I wonder what that means for the second half. Like, are we just going to get nothing? I don't know. There might be a lot of dead packs. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. Hey, that's not bad. The, um, the ability on this... Uh, if it has two energy attached to it, it can retreat for free. And then uh, this can do 120 plus 60 if it became the active Pokemon. So just like the old one, the GX one, not as crazy good because it does require four energy, but you could throw that triple boost energy on there. Uh, it's got, uh, this is a great potion, heals one of your GX's for 50, eh. Interesting that they're kind of bringing the potions back. Okay. I hope this is not just like a really boring second half of the box, we'll see. We must have another GX coming, if we got all three on one side. I don't know though, we'll see. Oh, slacking. There he is. Look at that. He's a big boy. He is a big boy. I like that artwork, actually. Okay. Alright, let's power through the rest. Still waiting for our hit. Oh, we got another one of those. Uh, what was it called? Pokemon Laboratory or whatever it is. I guess that's good with the Aerodactyl, you know. Oh, oh, we got something. We got something. Oh, all right, we got an alternate art. I like it. I really wish we got the Mewtwo one, just because I feel like that will be the most valuable one, and it looks really cool, but I like the look of this a lot. The texturing is crazy. I gotta show you guys. The texturing on that is so, like, if you look up here, it's really, like, spotty. It's, that's crazy. It's very detailed. I like that artwork a lot. It's just eating all the gems. Very nice. All right. So, we got an alternate art. There is three. So, we got probably the second best one, I, I guess. But, 
I'm happy with that. That's cool. They're hard to get. So no Misty, no uh, Mew Mewtwo, no. What was the other one I said? The Cherish Ball. Actually, we haven't even seen the Cherish Ball yet. What's going on? I feel like that's going to be expensive. All right, we got green there again. Yeah, I definitely feel like the Cherish Ball will be expensive, especially if they're this hard to get. Haven't even seen one yet. I assume we'll definitely get one in a box, but the fact that we haven't seen one yet is slightly discouraging. Oops. Um, oh, we haven't seen a trainer area. I wonder if that'll be in this pack. Nope. Necrozma. That's cool looking artwork. Nice. It's got a special energy attached to it. It can do 100 plus 60. That's kind of cool. Um, I like the artwork though. Very nice. All right, so we should still get a trainer rare to come. I wonder if we're gonna get another GX because this side of the box is very light. Oh, that's a crazy looking artwork. I like it. All right, what do we got? Okay. Okay, hey, are we gonna get another GX? I hope so. There we go. Ooh, mystery treasure. Trainer rare, that might be worth a bit, I think. I feel like that is a good one to get. Definitely. Yay. Nice. Alright, I'm very happy with that one. Alright, three packs to go. Can we spike another GX just to just to round it out? Oh, this is um What's her name? Conjurer or something? I gotta check what this does. It's the first one of these we've seen. The full art actually looks quite good as well. Um, Channeler. Channeler, not Conjurer. Uh, what does this do? So, Channeler removes all effects of attacks on you and your Pokemon. That's pretty good. Interesting. We got another fossil. Okay. We are still... Still waiting on the Cherish Ball. We must get one. We must do. I would be shocked if you don't get one. You usually get one of all of them in the box. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Something shiny in this pack. Hey, it's a Dragonite. We hadn't seen that yet. This is pretty good. Um, you can put a water and an electric energy from your deck onto your Pokemon in any way you like, which is pretty good. Um, yeah, there's some stuff which that would work well with, I guess. Um, but, yeah, stage two is, eh, it's not so bad. Alright, last pack. We gotta get a Cherish Ball in this pack, surely. We have to. I'm predicting it's gonna be the last card. No! What the heck? Stadium Navi. Uh, flip two coins for a heads you can get a stadium card out of your deck that's crazy we didn't even get one I feel like that means it's gonna be very expensive because uh, basically what it does it lets you I think it lets you get two GX's out of your deck maybe two basic like that's pretty good um, so obviously all the ball cards are gonna be like uh, when there's rotation so that's definitely gonna be very um, used, I should say. So we did only get three GXs. That one side of the box was very quiet. Although we did get our two one-off cards, which is good. Um, I'm reasonably happy with that. I'm disappointed that we didn't get... Did we not get one? I'm sure I didn't see one. Let me just double check. We got the giant bomb. We only got one of them. We got one Misty. Yeah, we didn't get it. That's that's unusual. I feel like that means we're either going to get uh, a bunch of them in the next box or they're just like impossible to get. We'll have to wait and see. All right, recap time. This is what we got. Um, we got the Glispod. We got the Dragonite. The Krasma. Velto. Slacking. Celebi. Tracheon. 
Uh, yeah, Aegis Lash. I'm pretty sure that is. I always forget this one. Elect. Uh, no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna guess what it is because people will make fun of me. <laughs> Tough Gogo. We got the Mystery Treasure Trainer Rare. I feel like that's probably the best one to get. Um, just off the top of my head. We got the Mega Sableye and uh, Tyranitar Tag Team GX. We got the Aerodactyl Tag Team. Uh, tag, not Tag Team, just regular GX. We got the best one, the Mew and the Mewtwo GX. And then, very nice looking card. We got our alternate art, which texturing is crazy good on this. It's very deep and, and detailed. Uh, Mega Sableye and Tyranitar again for the alternate art. I'm very happy with that. Hopefully it commands a good price, but don't know about this card. I don't know. There's not really any darkness like acceleration at the moment. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll have to see. Uh, but anyway, guys, that's it for now. Uh, I still have another box, which I'll be opening shortly. Let me know what you think. Check out the channel for more videos. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Take it easy.